You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. The reporter who penned a Mongabe piece on illegal logging in Cambodia has affirmed that he is not responsible for a news report published by the Cambodia Daily Khmer, alleging that Hun Manet is the mastermind behind the illegal timber trade network in Cambodia. The report from the Daily cited the Mongabe article with misrepresented information, and readers are urged to view the original investigative report instead. EAC News reporter Kristen Winters has the story. Responding to a question from EAC News on Thursday regarding the Cambodia Daily Khmer's misrepresentation of his investigative report on illegal logging, Gerald Flynn, the journalist who authored the original piece, asserted that he is not in charge for what the Cambodia Daily writes and suggests anyone who is confused about the situation should read the original report on Mongabai. The Cambodia Daily Khmer published an article on March 16th titled, International Press Reveals Hun Manet's Illegal Timber Trade Network. In the article, the Daily alleged that a UK-based news web portal called Mongabai published an investigative report revealing the chain of command behind major illegal logging activities in Cambodia, which implicated the Deputy Commander-in-Chief of the Royal Cambodian Armed Forces, Hun Manet, along with a three-star military general and senior official of the Ministry of Interior, Muk Sapanaret, also known as Okna Chai. Hun Manet has rejected the accusations made against him by the Cambodia Daily Khmer and stated that the news site misrepresented information from the original report. He has asked the U.S.-based Cambodia Daily to provide clear evidence of where the original Mongabai report explicitly states that he is behind an illegal logging operation in the country. Earlier this week, on Wednesday, the Cambodia Daily Khmer published another article detailing the structure of the Cambodian People's Party listing Hun Manet as the leader of the CPP Youth Organization and Muk Sopanareth as a member of the CPP Youth Working Group in the United States. This information is put forth as evidence for their accusation. The original Mongabai report, however, does not make any direct allegation against the RCAF Deputy Commander-in-Chief. Published on March 8th, Mongabai's report, Logged and Loaded, Cambodian Prison Officials Suspected in Massive Legalized Logging Operation, only explicitly names senior interior ministry official Muk Sapanareth as being directly involved in illegal logging operations in the country. The report goes into Sapanareth's background, identifying him as a member of the CPP Youth Working Group in the United States, and further noting Hun Manet as the CPP Youth Organization leader, but does not at any point explicitly accuse Hun Manet of being the mastermind behind illegal logging operations in Cambodia. On Sunday, during a ceremony at Sovankiri Pagoda in Thuong Knom province, Hun Manet said that the accusations made against him by the Cambodia Daily Khmer go beyond what he can accept, as he believes the news site deliberately misrepresented information from Mongabai's investigative report with malicious intent. Kristen Winters, EAC News.